with traffic and ordinance violations, file in the front door of the city hall, briefly appear before a judge, then file out the back. On this night, most were here for minor traffic violations. Terrence Jackson's offense, his car windows are tinted too dark. And he also gave me three tickets for tents and proper tags and no proof insurance, which I had both. I didn't have them on me at the time because I just moved out of here. Deborah McKinney was stopped for not having a front license plate, even though she says she had the damaged plate in the car. It's just ridiculous. And I had to take off from work just to come for something that is on my car. Is this the first time you've been ticketed for anything in one of these communities? No, it's not. St. Louis County's municipal courts are under intense scrutiny after a U.S. Justice Department report called Ferguson, Missouri's court a mechanism for making money on the backs of the poor. Calverton Park Mayor James Ponovich denies that's the case here. No. I think quota systems are stupid. I think anybody that comes out with a quota system is is. is, is it's crazy. I, I don't. I don't. I would not allow it in my community at all. But a recent report by St. Louis-based nonprofit Better Together found that Calverton Park collects more than 20 percent of its general revenues from court fines and fees. That's about twice as much as the majority of the county's other municipalities. A missed court appearance for a traffic offense can result in additional fines and even jail time if a judge issues an arrest warrant. Attorney Brendan Rodiger says he's represented hundreds of clients who faced hundreds of dollars in fines in many communities. He calls it a broken system. These are part-time courts, meaning that judges are not there ready to meet with those folks, review bond, figure out whether they can be released. So they will sit sometimes for days and sometimes for weeks before they have an opportunity to be released. Shouldn't you be going to jail for a minor traffic offense? No, no. Wesley Bell is a part-time municipal judge in nearby Belda City and is running for a seat on the Ferguson City Council. As a judge, he says he tries to work with defendants, but acknowledges that not every judge may be doing that. He says the municipal court system should be reformed. What I would recommend is once the person is hired, they serve a year or two year term. So at the very least, they're not looking over their shoulder every night wondering, am I, am I bringing in enough money? For many of these defendants, their cases were continued, so they won't know if and how much they'll owe the city until their next court appearance.